Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I wasn't going to do this video for another week, but I had such a great week of hunting for ammo that I decided to go and put my week's worth of ammo hunt uh, into one video by itself. You saw my first video that I put out of what it took me about two weeks to find. Well, this is everything that I've bought this week. I had a fantastic week for finding ammunition. All right, so some of this you saw in one of my other videos just a second ago. But uh, let's start off with this brown box stuff here. This is... 12 gauge double lot buck um, they listed as military grade uh, I don't know I've never shot this stuff before I don't know if it's any good or not but I figured some was better than none so I've been able to find I have five boxes of this stuff that I was able to pick up uh, I got this stuff the other day um, Found this at a Walmart. They were just starting to unbox their ammo shipment for the day. 100 round 9 millimeter. This was $24 for this box. These were 5 bucks a box. So it's a buck a round for the double lot. Uh, 9 millimeter was $0.24 cents a round at $24 for the box. Uh, I found two boxes of Winchester 3030. So I was very happy about that. I got two boxes of 308 180 grain. Uh, I didn't actually buy this for myself. One of the uh, new subscribers to my channel, uh, give a shout out, you know who you are. Uh, he just recently purchased his first uh, 308 centerfire rifle, uh, AR-10. And so I bought this as a congratulations and here's my contribution to your personal defense to freedom. So these are yours, buddy. Uh, next, uh, the first time we get a chance to hook up and go to the range, they're yours. Um, I bought... Uh, you saw this in this other video. If you haven't seen it yet, there's a link below. Um, this is 556. I bought this from a local gun store. They have a limit of five boxes per caliber. So I bought five boxes of this one day, and then I went back the next day, and they were all out of the Winchester white box. So I bought uh, five boxes of the PMC X Tac. Now these were this came really close to to biting me in the butt with the dollar around protest that I'm on. This was a uh, 80 cents a round after tax and everything like that. It was actually up to 96 cents a round. Uh, I probably won't ever do that again. Um, I wanted to do it just to kind of prove a point uh, in comparison with Walmart prices and whatnot. So uh, all you price gougers, you can go take your ammo and shove it. Um, this was just, this is, oh, I was so happy about this. I got to another Walmart um I won't tell you what time of day or anything like that because it different is different between all the Walmarts. But uh, my Walmart, the closest one, was just about getting ready to put their ammo out. There was already a couple people there, and I asked them what they were waiting for, and they said that uh, they told me which time was the, the correct hour, the witching hour for ammo. So I got in line, and I was the third person there, and they had probably like six cases of this stuff. Um, so I was able to buy three. Unfortunately, they've limited it to three per person. But uh, this is $100 worth of ammo, so that was probably more than enough for this this uh, this purchase. These were $35 bucks a piece for 100 rounds, so that's $0.35 cents a round. Very, 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 very happy with that. I was able to get three boxes. So I've got 500 rounds here of 223 and 556 that, that uh, I acquired this week. Very, very happy about that. I cannot tell you how happy I am. And then this I bought just... Um, for some reason, this shotgun ammo is, is getting really scarce and harder to find these big boxes. So this is 12 gauge, target round, eight shot, um, two and three quarter inch uh, shell. So I bought this, there's 100 rounds in here. It was uh, $26, I believe. So I've got a bunch of boxes of these around. You know, you can use this stuff for, for game uh, in a pinch. It's not, it's not the good high quality stuff, but uh, you can use it for that. So I wanted to add another box since it was the only, pretty much the only thing that they had that I, that I would even be remotely interested in. So all in all, I'm very happy. I have uh, um, I've got a 30-30. That's kind of my odd caliber. Uh, otherwise, I've got the the AR for the 223556. Most all my handguns are nine millimeter, and then I've got a couple shotguns that are all 12 gauge. So this covers the gamut of all the different firearms I have. And then, like I said, I got this for. Uh, the buddy, the local guy. So hey, and that's uh, let me say that really quick. If you're a local to the Denver area and you happen to be watching this channel, shoot me a message. I'm trying to get a bunch of us together so we can go out and go shooting and all that kind of stuff. Uh, have some have some fun and just get to know each other and you know form our own little club or whatever you want to call it. I don't care, but uh, 
so that's uh, that's the ammo haul for this week. I can't tell you how uh, just so happy I am about all this stuff. 100 rounds and nine, 500 rounds of 2.33 and 5.56, just ecstatic. So that's my ammo haul for this week. I'm probably going to slow down a little bit just because I think I'm at the point now where the stuff I buy future purchases is going to be the stuff that I'm going to actually be able to take out to the range and go shoot. I've got enough um, stored of all of my calibers that I, I can, I feel like I can just start going back to the range and, and, uh, and, and practicing and, and shooting and whatnot. So, um, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what kind of ammo finds you guys have been able to find and, and where you've been able to find it. Uh, if you've got any secret gems of, uh, well, it wouldn't be secret if you told anybody, but if you've got some resources that you want to share with everybody on where to get ammo, then, uh, please do. So thanks again for watching. And, uh, Y'all have a nice day. God bless our military service members past and present. Keep your powder dry, folks.